Hi guys, my name is Dimitri Maramonides and today I want to talk about the new golf bag that we have. Uh, actually, as you can see right here, this is the um, two partition golf bag uh, we made uh, for Epic Heights. So the top one is the light one. It has no wheels, nothing. It's very light. And then the second partition is the bottom one. The bottom one is the main one that has wheels and this is what you drag. So then once you are uh, all set up and all the kites and boards are in, then you can clip them and just pull them out. Okay, so let me show you what can fit inside these bags. In, in these two bags, as you can see, we have lots of equipment all around me. So all these fits in these two bags. Okay, uh, this kite. I won't use this kite. This is my uh, this is the race kite, so it's not going to go in. Uh, we're not going for racing. We're going to have uh, fun. So what I'm going to do is today is I'm going to take. Uh, I'm going to show you how to pack seven kites. You can pack at least ten kites, depending on the sizes. But then you are becoming like over the limit of what the um, uh, airlines restriction is. You know, it's like 50 pounds and all that. So you have to be careful in how many bags you have. Also, um, for the golf bags, uh, we got away with the golf bags a lot, but now the airlines got smarter. So now even golf bags, they charge, you know. So, uh, but what they don't charge, and this is a hint, is medical equipment. So if you go on the counter and you're checking your baggage, just tell them one of the bags is medical equipment. And this helps a lot. This helps a lot. They see you with that. So even if you're not hurt, just bring one of those things. Just buy one of those, put in your leg and pretend you, you're camping. And then one of the bags just say medical uh, um, uh, medical equipment. Okay, so these are the two um, golf bags that we have here. Um, so I'm going to show you what we can put in. I'm going to take, uh, I'm going to go to a place. I mean, it, a normal kiter doesn't have to take nine or ten kites or seven kites. You know, a normal kiter needs only one, two, three kites and one board. Okay, but since I go to places and I go kite, then I get people, oh, can I try? Oh, can I try? And then I end up not even kiting. So that's why I'm bringing extra kites so people can demo the kites and I can go and have fun too. So uh, I'm a little bit different. Uh, so I'm packing with me today seven kites, okay? So I'm going to bring two twin tips. I'm going to bring the Spartan uh, 129 by 39 and also the Droid 135 by 41. Those are the, uh, and the place I'm going is, it's, it's windy, you know, it doesn't go lower than uh, 12 knots. So I don't need to bring uh, the oxygen or I don't need to bring the infinity kite. Uh, so what I'm going to bring is, on Screamers, I'm, I'm going to bring the Screamer 14, Screamer 10, Screamer 12, and also Screamer 7. Those will be for my, because the place I'm going also has uh, some waves and also a lot of flat water. So uh, I want to bring also my wave kites. So uh, I'm bringing my screamers for big johns, big air, big, you know, like free ride. So the Screamer 14, Screamer 10, Screamer 12, and Screamer 7. But I'm also bringing the Renegade 9 and Renegade 11. Plus, also, a lot of people want to try the judges. So whenever I go, they're like, oh, do you have the judge? Oh, I want to try it. So I'm going to bring also the judge 11. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six kites. Uh, and I might even bring the um, Renegade 13 if we have space. And we do have a lot of space left. But I'm trying to constrain on the weight limit. Okay, so these are the things I'm going to pack in uh, the bag. Plus, I'm going to bring a harness with me. We have a harness here, a pump. Definitely, don't forget a pump. This happened to me once and I will never forget that. So make sure you bring your pump with you. I'm gonna bring three bars. Two of the bars are the 22 meter lines and I like to have two bars, uh, especially if something happens to one bar, I have another one. Uh, and also if uh, you do, you know, people wanna use your car and demo them, then, you know. So it's good to take three to four bars. Now the third bar is my, uh, it's the 50 meter lines. So um, it's for my wave kite for the Renegade. So three bars here, you have a 22, 22 and 50 meter lines. Uh, it'll be good to add another bar if you want, but three is enough, okay? Then also I have with me my kite aid patch right here. This is very good inside. You have all the patches in case something happens to your kite. Make sure to bring that. Plus, I have also this. And this inside, you have screws, you have uh, screwdrivers, you have everything, uh, extra patch, valves, whatever you need in case something happens to your board or to your kite. Uh, same thing with the epoxy and all that, okay? Those are the main thing you want to bring, plus a uh, t-shirt maybe, bathing suit, rash guard, and flip-flops. Uh, all these goes inside of it. So let me show you um, the, uh, the bags, how they work, and how you pack them. So right now, you have two, compart uh, two compartments. Uh, you can buy these uh, two bags separately 
or uh, as a one unit or as two units, okay, depending on what you want to do. Um, so anyway, let me, uh, I'm going to show you around. So we're going to, uh, right here you have, what you have here is once you pack everything and you, you have something wet or you want to put some clothes or another kite, it's very good because here you have another compartment you can put your stuff in, okay. So this is one zipper and then here, let me open it and then, that's my son. Kevin! I bet he's laughing somewhere. Zeus, get out. Come on, out. The dog is not included. Cameron loves playing jokes. I, actually, we play a lot of jokes together, so. But uh, that, that was pretty funny. Uh, so this is the bag. Let's open it entirely. There we go. So right here, you have another compartment, zipper, so you can put whatever you want here. Okay. Then here on the side, you have another compartment and you have plenty of pockets here so you can put the thin screwdrivers whatever you can even put your bars here so this is where we're going to put our bars uh, or anything you want okay so this is on the main big bag so what we're going to do here is we're going to put one board here and then we're going to put the other board over there okay and then we're going to start filling them up so um, right now let me show you here the bag I'm going to close it once you're done you have clips here so you can remove this this is a strap because if you want to carry just one bag and carry the other one that's perfect but when you go to attach them together all you have to do is remove this and then remove this and this you can just pack it inside the bag so let's put it inside the bag okay and then once you're done you're all packed all you have to do is just clip it here clip it here and same thing here clip it and clip it and then you're set to go you just drag it okay but we're not packed so let me open I will show you this later so let's put that bag here let's open this okay it's ready this is the strap that we took from there so let me open you let me open this so you see this is the other bag that's a smaller bag it's very light so you open it here I got some straps here for the kites and here inside you have another pocket so you can secure or put whatever you want okay so we're going to start by putting uh, the boards first so you want to put the boards and I like to keep the boards in their bags so the fins everything doesn't scratch the bag when you drag and also all the boards are already set up so there's the foot straps the fins everything is on it you don't need to do anything so when you get to the beach because it always happens you know I get to the beach I'm like oh, oh it's blowing and I'm trying to put my foot straps everything so in this case now, it's, everything is all set, you know, they all set. So all you have to do is just, boom, remove the board, uh, the bag out of this bag and you're all set. So let me get this. So I have to know this one is a Spartan. So I'm going to put, so I know where the kites are and the boards are. So what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to put uh, all the Renegades and Judge in this bag and the Screamer on the bigger one. Okay, so it, it's nice to know where the kites are and boards. So perfect here. And then this here, and that's the droid. So it's all set. People are seeing me with this. They're like, well, what happened? Well, I gotta let you know, this did not happen kiteboarding. Okay, this happened in tennis. I torn the Achilles tendon two weeks ago. So um, it's healing. But anyway, uh, so let's put uh, the uh, screamers over there. So you come here, actually over there, take these bars. Open here. Actually, no, let's put the bars here. A little bit better on the side here. There. And here, we're going to put this. This. And if we need anything else we have later on, we can come back and put other stuff, fins or whatever. Even food, power bars. So we have it here. So now I'm going to start with this and I'm going to put the bigger kite, the Screamer 14. There it is. I want to open it. As you can see, all my kites don't have bags, okay? You don't need bags when you travel because it adds weight and it adds, um, you know, there's less space in it. So remove all the bags, leave the bags at home. So then you open this. Perfect. Then you take the other screamer. It's good to have those with you, all the straps. So put them on the side right now or just hide them in the bag. Then you open. 12, right 
here. Perfect. Then you take the seven. Right here. Perfect. And now the 10, there it is. You take the 10. Okay. So right now we're perfect. We have all that in. See, there's, there's extra pockets here for whatever you want to put. So we can put even the straps here, inside here. But right now, let's close it. So we bring this here. Close all this. I'm going a little bit fast, so... Make sure the guys don't catch to the zipper. Put your hand in. See, there's plenty of space. Okay, here, put your hand in. Perfect. There we go. Okay, so right now we have all the screamers in and there's still a little bit of space here. You can put other stuff that you want. I'll put my harness here. So I know where my harness is. It's right here. Perfect. There we go. Okay, now the first bag is ready to go. So if you travel only with um, three kites and one bore harness, you don't need two bags. Just one is enough. This is the one and you know, you can just uh, travel with that. Also, if you want to make it smaller, you can tie it here. See these here? They make the bag smaller and tighter. So pull it on each side. See how small it got? Again, I can put another kite, another small kite here. But let's go to the other one and let's put whatever I have left. I have left a pump and three more kites. So let's put the 11 first. I'm gonna open it. There we go. And then I'll come here and take the 11 and the nine. Straps out. You can put these straps inside there if you want. Or you can leave the straps on. Actually, it will fit. So just want to show you how everything goes in. There we go. Then you come here. You close this, make sure to put your hand in so you don't rip the uh, guides. Okay, perfect. There we go, it's pretty easy. Then you bring this on top. Of course, I still need to pack maybe a wetsuit or flip flops, a rash guard, maybe an extra bar. There's still a lot of space in it, okay? Right now, this is probably, I'll say maybe. 30 pounds and the other one is already 50 pounds okay so I can put another 20 pounds here so let me um, clip it so I come here see how easy it is you just come here clip this then you come here clip this and then you go on the other side bring this here release a little bit and then bring that here Clip here, release a little bit so you can hook it in. So it's a clip, and then you can pull everything. Everything. So there you go. So now you're all set to go. Oh, I forgot these. So again, you can open it here and put this inside here and close it again. But again, if you have other stuff to, uh, to put in, you know, there's still a lot of space, okay? And when you're ready, just grab it. And it's very easy to, even in one leg, very easy. You have those wheels, bottom really thick, reinforced. So everything is ready to go. Again, the golf bag has sold in two units or in one unit. So you can buy the top, you can buy the bottom, or you can buy both of them together. You can get all these and they're very easy to roll, see? It's hard for me to walk a little bit with a cast, 
but very easy. And you have two grabs. One grab here. Let's say if someone wants to help you and there's sand or whatever and you cannot go through, so you can grab here and the other guy can go on the back and grab here too. You can see the wheels and the grab. So again, this is the epic golf bag that you can call also medical equipment. So anyway, let me pack this. Hopefully I can go kiting.